Hi folks. This is my Actron OBD2 pocket scan code reader for uh, reading automotive codes. Uh, now I'll, I'll tell you that this is something I recommend everybody have that owns a car. Uh, if you don't have one of these things, when the check engine light comes on, you have no idea what's wrong with it, what it's going to take to fix it, or even if it needs to be fixed right away. And uh, what that can mean is that you're going to spend a whole lot of extra money uh, and have a lot of worry if, uh, if you can't read those codes on your car or your truck. Uh, now this is very inexpensive one and I checked on Amazon just before I made this video and they, they sell for about forty dollars on Amazon uh, it's it's well worth that money it really is everybody should have one of these things now I recently had to get my Toyota Corolla smogged and uh, it it didn't have any codes but there were a couple of things that needed to be dealt with uh, it's called I am readiness and a couple of those were not ready uh, now when you go to get your car smogged in California there are some of those codes that the DMV will allow but you're not allowed to have more than one of them uh, as of right now when this video is being made and I had two uh, I had two of those codes so I had to take care of one of them and one of them was acceptable to the DMV to allow my car to be driven legally on the street to be registered so I'm gonna show you uh, a little bit about hooking it up here. Now the place to hook up your code reader will be underneath the steering wheel, underneath the dash on the driver's side. They're pretty much always uh, right there and this is what they look like. So I'm gonna hook mine up and show you what we get. Now on this code reader uh, I've got it hooked up now and on this one you need to push this button here and it'll scan the computer in the, in the, in the car or the truck and once it's done that it'll it says zero codes which is a good thing but if I push this down uh, the monitor I have one that's not ready and that's my evap cool my evap sensor is is not uh, functioning properly and I suppose I could replace that I don't intend to do that though since this car is now legal to drive but uh, at least I know what it is anyway uh, I just wanted to show this and encourage people to get one of these things because it really can help you uh, save a lot of money and you know keep you you know some peace of mind about your vehicle uh, be a smart thing to take on a trip uh, or even just keep in the in the vehicle all the time so if, if that check engine light comes on you'll know what you're up against and you'll know whether or not you need to go to a mechanic right away fix it yourself you'll know how to fix it or what needs to be fixed uh, and it really is a smart thing to have so that's really about it. Thanks for watching.